Hi. Hopefully by now you've already finished your summer homework. If not, I hope you still have a few hours or a few days. I'm making this video before midnight on the 1st of September because it just came to me today that I should I have to make this video. Me giving you advice, if you're going into your first year of university, you're going into your first year of high school, this is the advice I have for you. So your form one, it's new school, new people. Let's be honest, you're gonna get lost. And you're gonna start having crushes on other people you shouldn't be having crushes on. And the worst part is, your teenage life hasn't even officially started yet. Form two, same school, you're familiar with the environment, Everything feels pretty comfortable, you feel safe, and that's when you hit form 3. You've made it mid-bottom of the high school food chain. Your teenage hormones, the teenage testosterone, it's kicking in. You're angsty, of course you are, you're 14. No one's taking you seriously, but at the same time, they're still telling you to act like a grown-up. And some classmates and teachers by this point should be pissing you off. But it's all good, you're having fun being an angsty teenager. The one thing most Form 1 to Form 3 students have in common is that you're probably going to be making really bad decisions and making really bad selfie choices that you will later on laugh at in a few years time. So you have that to look forward to. High school is a magnet for bad decisions and it's also the best place to actually make them. And usually if you're in the Form 1 to Form 3 category, you might have a sweater vest as your uniform and you might be wearing it. You know why? Because the boys were teasing you because you didn't have boobs. Or they were teasing you because you had boobs. You can't win with boys. They're stupid. You're just going to have to get used to it. Boys are either going to tease you for not having boobs or having boobs. So that's why you're wearing your sweater vest. And if you are fortunate, or unfortunate, to be attending a girls' school, I guess you'll be wearing that sweater vest either way because your confidence is low at that age and trust me, you will gain that confidence, just not yet. Form 4, you're higher up in the high school food chain, congratulations. Life, high school life is stable, you have more tedious homework, you have more group projects, but that's okay because you know why? You have high school cred. The lower forms, they think you're practically an adult and by now, your parents probably pretend to take you seriously. Form 5, you're 16, whoa, you're still alive? Then damn, you're officially a teenager in my books. Form 5, or when you're 16, you're in for a world of fun and drama. And possibly for most of you, by this age, you're not gonna wear that sweater vest anymore because magically, you gain confidence overnight. For some, Boobs are probably your best asset. So for all the boys and girls who made it to 16 years old, give yourself a pat on the back for even getting this far. Just a heads up, boys get dumber and girls get more emotional at this age. Hence the drama and fun. It's deliciously chaotic. The weirdest part about going up to Form 5 is that you're going to want to start touching people. Don't have sex because you will get chlamydia and you'll die. Boom, Form 6. You're starting to panic. Why? You're panicking that you haven't done enough. You haven't achieved enough. You haven't accomplished enough. You're feeling the pressure because it's no longer all fun and games. Things are getting real. Cats. Because you suddenly realize that you thought you would have accomplished much more by this age. And you haven't. Breathe. Don't panic. You still have one more year to fuck up. Form 7? Whoa, whoa! You're 18 and you're still in school? You are now officially the majority. You're the majority of people who believe in education. So take a moment to realize and thank your lucky stars that not many people make it to where you are right now. First year of uni. Well, you're on your own from here because I can't help you. Not because I don't want to. It's because I didn't make it this far. Am I the minority or the majority now? I'm proud of you. You made it to university. Good luck with those student loans. Until next week. Wait, no. Until the next video. Peace.